What's good, YouTube? It's your man, Spiel Dog. I don't think Ryan gonna rematch Devin. Uh, I, I mean, you know, uh, how many times they gonna fight? You know, they fought six times in the amateur. It was uh, three to three, and he beat him in the pros. I think, I think that's enough. You know, uh, I mean, be honest with you, I, uh, Devin still got the belt, so he ain't lost his title, and Ryan got the win. You know, uh, I think it's gonna stay right there. I, I, I doubt very seriously Ryan gonna fight him again because. He can get, you know, he can get a lot of money fighting other fighters. And how many times you gonna fight the same person? I mean, that's seven fights. I mean, it was even in the amateurs. I mean, what keep fighting them? And I mean, they'll never stop if that's the case. Look like they gonna go back and forth if they fight. So, I, I, I mean, you know, uh, you know, Ryan could rematch Tank. He can fight for one of the other belts. He could have a, a, a. a, a with a, you know, a unification fight with uh, Matthias or, or, or Teo. I mean, it's, it's, it's a, you know, I'm sorry, he don't have the belts, but he can he can challenge somebody else for their title. There's a lot of things he can do now. If he's going to stay at 140, uh, well, to be honest with you, look like he might need to move up to 147 because if he can't make 140, I mean, uh, I don't think I don't think Devin would jump out there again if he was three pounds heavy. If they was signed for another fight, I just don't see him fighting again. I don't I, I don't see the reason to. You know, uh, it don't it ain't gonna change Devin life because he lost that fight. I mean, you know, I mean, it, you know, yeah, he gonna feel a little bad for a little while, but he's still the champion and he can fight on. And uh, maybe maybe Ryan need to move up to 147 pounds if he can't make 140. Uh, because you know he you know he clearly don't want to be weight drained if he fight and if he couldn't make 140 as much time in advance he knew that he had this fight he damn sure ain't gonna be able to do it and if he wasn't motivated to fight Devin to make 140 who else gonna you know what I'm saying so I mean uh you know more likely that's the you know that saga is over uh Devin's gonna have to uh live with that one. But I just don't see no reason for them to fight again. I honestly don't. Uh, what weight they gonna fight at? 145 pounds. You know, don't like Ryan can make 140. I mean, he didn't even try to. So, I mean, uh, what sense would it make for them to uh, set up another big title fight and he go in there and don't make weight? They ain't gonna fall for the banana in the tailpipe again. They won't fight next time if it happened again. So. I think that ship to sail, you know, unless they fight later on down the line at well twenty. I'm thinking Ryan probably gonna move up more than likely, uh, cause like I said, look like he having problem making one forty and he don't wanna be weight drained when he fight uh unless he gonna try to add that fight with Tank, but I don't think so because Tank ain't gonna fight at no disadvantage. Uh Floyd ain't gonna let him. And I don't think, you know, if if they fought at one forty, it'd be the same thing Ryan said at one thirty five. He was weight drained, so that fight probably won't happen either. Uh, maybe he will go try to fight Boots or somebody at 147. Uh, why not? You know. Uh, but I think I think Devin missed the boat on that one. I think he I think that uh, I think he should have handled business uh, last night. I do not see them fighting again. Uh, you know why would you why would you why would you sign up for another fight with him if he couldn't make weight this time? He ain't gonna make weight again, so. Ain't no sense of going down that street no more. Uh, I think that's the end of that. And maybe, you know, the Hayes probably to be looking in a different direction anyway because Ryan was landing them big punches at will on him. Uh, you know, I think I think he may need to go to the draw board and, and, and see what happened with that defense uh, because here's a shot you knew. Everybody in boxing knew. That's his money punch, the left hook. And that's the first thing he's supposed to take away from him. That's what Tank did, you know and, and it looked like he either, he, he, like he didn't know how to take it away from him. Like he just, like he couldn't just hold the phone and keep his hand up. And, uh, and you know, uh, I think Bernard Hop Hopps used to call it the bow and arrow. I do notice when Devin throw his left hook or his or jab with his left hand. Well, I mean, you know, he dropped that right hand and Ryan was catching him every time. That's why when Devin would punch, he would throw the hook with it. When he would shoot a jab up top or throw his left hook, Ryan would let his go because he dropped his he dropped his hand every time. Uh, I think that's something they definitely need to get in the gym and correct. But 
I don't even know if it'd be smart for them to go right back in the ring with Ryan Garcia uh, after this right here. Uh, and once again, if he didn't make that weight this time, he definitely ain't gonna make it the next time. So why would you go that route? But uh, that's it for me on this video. If you like the video, hit the like and subscribe. Till the next time, it's your boy Spill Dog. I'm out.